Tell a friend to tell a friend that do it all haulers in. And as you can see, we are back with some more of my team, man. I decided to try to build my roster right. And as you can see, I'm on the screen now where I'm trying to get this Kristoff Pazingas card, man. And this is my first time going to the auction. And I really wanted to get this card, man, because I've been playing against a bunch of them. And it's a really, really good build. And I'm on here for the first time. I don't know what the hell I'm doing, but I'm trying to kind of snipe this build. That they, that's the term they use. I'm trying to snipe it. Um, and as you can see, I'm taking my bid amount up. And I'm trying to wait to the last couple of seconds because I didn't want to pay the 20-some thousand MT for it. You know what I'm saying? I want to try to get it a little cheaper. I still probably pay too much for it. I don't know. But um, I'm trying to get this uh, car right here, man. And as you can see, I tried to do it for 15. They said it wasn't high enough. And then I had to take it up to 16.5. And bam, I had to take it up again before the second ending. And there we go. We did get the Chris Bazinga. As you can see, I didn't pay the $24,000 for it, uh, which was pretty good. Um, I paid $18,256. That's what I paid for it. And I didn't even know what was going on. I didn't even know if I won the card or not. So as you can see, I'm trying to go in there and see, did I actually win the bid, man? You know, And as you can see, they told me I won. And there we go, man. I won the Kristoff Pazingas card, man. That's a great card to add to my lineup. And you know I'm adding to my collection. I ain't trying to sell it. I just bought it. And that's crazy, man. You pay 18000 MT for it, and they try to get you to sell it for three. Come on, 2K. Y'all got to stop that bull crap, man. You know what I'm saying? So um, I'm going back and trying to get to my roster, man. I was looking for the card. I'm like, where the hell the card at, man? Where the hell the uh, Kristoff Pazingas card at? You know what I'm saying? And I got that Carlos Boozer. That's pretty good, too. So that Christophe Pazingas card would really help out my lineup, man. It'll help me um, get some more height, man. I'm trying to get more taller players in my lineup. And as you can see, um, I have Kareem. He's probably the tallest on my team. Or maybe um, him, either him or Christophe Pazingas right now. As you can see, I had to go in there and make sure I had the card. You know what I'm saying? I do have the card right there, as you guys can see. And um, I had to go back to my roster and put put Christoph Bazingas in my lineup, you know what I'm saying? Because that card is is really good, man. I've been playing against a bunch of people with that card, and I'm trying to get more height in my lineup, as you can see. Like I said, I got that Steph Curry, but he's small. But that's like my secret weapon. I ain't gonna lie. That's like my they go they go to Christoph Bazingas card right there. That's like my secret weapon right there, man. You know when I need some three point shots. And the rest of my t roster is, is not bad, but it's like I, I need more height, man. It's certain players that I want to add to my lineup. And, you know, i just been paying attention to what players can do what. And I want to try to get them in my lineup. And I don't spend no money on this game. This is a no money spent type of deal right here with me. I don't I don't buy VC. I don't uh, buy nothing. You know what I'm saying? I go do the quest on the regular uh, uh, 2K. Not to my team. I just go do the quest. And then I get the VC like that. As you can see, I'm sitting at 24,000 VC right now. But my MT is only 6000 right now. I got to build that back up, you know, by doing the um, challenges or whatnot. So I will be doing that. And as you can see, um, I got Kristoff Pazingas in my lineup. Uh, we got we got a pretty good card right there, man. I like that card, man. Look at that, man. That that card right there is truly, truly amazing. I ain't going to lie, man. They had that boy out there going crazy. Seven foot three. You know what I'm saying? Like, look at the grades, man. We, we like that, man. You know what I'm saying? We're going to take that any day. And I know I'm new. Uh, to, to uh, certain cards and stuff but I mean it's no better time for me than now you know some of my subscribers were telling me to come over here and do my team and guess what I'm going to try to do my team to uh, finish out NBA 2K23 so I start fresh on NBA 2K24 doing my team man put some time into that after I learned the builder but you know it's, it's a challenge and I'm, I'm learning you know I'm learning the terminology so this can only help the channel grow you know, for the audience that want to see the my team, I will be able to bring you some my team content, and that's what it's all about. It's all about elevating, man. It's all about, um, you know, learning new things, bringing new things to the table, man, and hopefully that can bring some more people to this channel. And you know, the people that are already here, you know, I appreciate them. But this my team thing is really fun. You know, if you got a good roster. It can be fun, you know what I'm saying? But if you don't have the proper players on your team, you're not going to win a whole lot of games. And I wanted to make sure that I got certain people in my lineup. So what I wanted to do was I want to kind of see the prices of certain players that I want in my lineup, right? So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go to the auction thing. Like I said, this was my first time just uh, going to the auction. But, you know, I'm slowly learning and trying to figure out 
how I can get certain players in my lineup, how I can snipe certain players. And I have a list of players that I want to use in my lineup. I want a really, really tall lineup. I want that Yao Ming card. <clears throat> Excuse me. I want that Yao Ming card. I ain't going to lie. That card right there is crazy. And I really want that card. And as you can see, um, you got some people, they got it for, you know, 100 or 85 by now. You know what I'm saying? The bid even 85 right there on that one. Um, the bid is thirty-seven thousand. That I wish I had something close to that. You know what I'm saying? I can try to go get that card, man. But you know, that's one of the players that I want in my lineup. You know, I want to be able to, you know, have people out of position and stuff like that. You know, I do want to try to get this Victor Wimbenyama card. I know everybody's gonna try to get that. But as you can see, it's pretty high right there. But not really. You know what I'm saying? Ninety some thousand VC. He out of his mind with uh, with with that right there. Seven hundred ninety thousand MT. Not my not VC. But, you know, around the 80s and things of that nature, I think that would be good for my team, man. If I can get him on my team, that would be really, really good. But I got to get my MT up, as you guys can see. And, um, yeah, man, 97,000 MT is not that bad, you know what I'm saying, for the Victor Wimbenyama. That's another one that I want to try. And, like I said, I want height, man. I want everybody tall on my team. So, why not try to get Bo, Bo, okay? Bow Bowl is tall as hell. And as you can see, he's not that expensive, especially them right there. I wish I had a little bit more um, MT. I could try to get him for, you know, maybe 30 or 40,000 MT or something like that. You know what I'm saying? But six is not bad. I don't think that's bad for uh, Bow Bow. Uh, 50 something is not that bad, as you can see. I really want that card right there, man. But them right there got 45 uh, Hall of Fame badges, but these got 30. You know, but that one with 45 Hall of Fame badge was a little bit more, which is okay. You know what I'm saying? And um, another person I wanted to get was this out of position, Jokic. I really would love to have that, man. I've been playing against people, and I got a little bit of step curve right there trying to guard Jokic. As you can see, it say point guard and center, okay? Point guard and center for this Jokic uh, card, man. And I've been seeing people play with it. Look at that, man. The buy now. It's only 29,000 MT, man. I wish I had 29,000, but I'm pretty sure I'll be able to get that, man. Once I get done um, doing the, uh, the challenges and things of that nature, man, I'll build my MT back up, you know, sell some things, sell some cars or whatnot, and try to get my MT up so I can come and get me a Jokic card. You know what I'm saying? That one right there is freaking 11,000 on the bid. So I know for a fact I'll be able to try to, you know, snipe one of those Jokic cards, man. That would be really, really good. You know what I'm saying? Another one that I wanted, which I know I'm not going to get this end game Kevin Durant, but if I could get the end game Kevin Durant, that bill right there, is, I mean, that card is going to be crazy. I keep saying bill. That card is going to be crazy. As you can see, it's 100,000 VC. I would pay that for a Kevin Durant end game, but I'm going to try to do some, some uh, pull some cards or whatever and see can I get me some end game players. I think I have that card right there, man. It's going for. 7,950 uh, MT. So I want to try to get that end game Kevin Durant if I can. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, just, just continue to build my lineup. You know, this is my lineup right now, and I'm going to keep getting better. I want to keep getting taller players, um, and that's about it, man. Charge!